10. Sleep apnea can cause stroke and heart problems, but you might not even know you have it. Mary Nichols has more for you in tonight's Check Your Health Report. I very suddenly felt confused in my head. A few weeks ago, 78-year-old Malin Jackson suffered a stroke. I did have weakness in my right side. I've had therapy and that's getting better. Aside from therapy, doctors also recommended that Malin undergo a sleep study to see if he had sleep apnea. One more thing that we can do to try to prevent future strokes from happening is to evaluate for sleep apnea. Dory Patterson is a nurse practitioner at the sleep clinic at Utah Valley Regional Medical Center. The clinic is currently doing a study to further understand a possible link between sleep apnea and strokes. Sleep apnea occurs when a person briefly stops breathing while they're sleeping. The biggest problem that we have is that 80 to 85 percent of everybody with sleep apnea still remains undiagnosed. Wayne Woodward is also assisting with the study. He says numbers show that many people who suffered a stroke had sleep apnea. The data is, is very strongly supports that uh, that if we treat sleep apnea in, patient, in stroke patients who have sleep apnea, if we treat those patients, uh, we have much better outcomes. Risk factors for sleep apnea include age, obesity, hypertension, and snoring. Experts say if you suspect you have sleep